Hello everybody, this is Frony to Bobble here, and welcome back to, um, Thingy. Yeah, we're back here playing Train Simulator 2, and today we're heading to the Outback Australia route. Yep, um, yeah, today's, yeah, we, we were at the British Midlands yesterday, that went well, this is down here in Australia. We're gonna be doing the Midday Passenger Session, I'm not sure how long this is going to take, but we'll find out. So, it's simple. Uh, drive the midday passenger service, stopping at all stations. This is the basic session requiring no manual junction operations or coupling. Good, good. So this scenario is going to be another chill scenario, just like, like yesterday's scenario. Um, only we're driving Australian motor cars, also known as the Red Hen. Um, these things don't have particularly good brakes, so I'm going to... Should we... Now nah, let's do a realistic mode. Give, our, give ourselves an extra challenge. Good afternoon. You'll be driving the midday passenger run, stopping at all the stations. All junctions will be switched for you. Alrighty. You are scheduled to depart at 12.04 p.m. Wait here a moment Wait a while the final passengers board. Do not depart until given the right way by the guard. Um, okay, so for some reason it's giving us these simple controls. That's probably better. So these, um, they're pretty cool cars. So we're gonna. So if we go into map view, um, this is the full route. It's very, very, very basic. Um, all junctions will be switched for us, and uh, we're gonna be driving. Yeah, I guess we're gonna be driving in easy mode today. I was gonna. I was planning on doing realistic, but nope. I guess easy mode it is. Plus, it's probably better off that we're in easy mode because the brakes on these aren't that great. No. I've driven these things before, and their braking is... Nah. It's... It's not the worst braking in the world, but it's... Not... It's not the greatest. So it's probably best off that we're in easy mode for today. Right away, passengers have boarded and door their clothes. Proceed when ready. Alrighty. We shall go. And it looks like... Uh, we're already gonna have a red light on this journey. Also, since we're in Australia, we'll be driving in kilometers for today. I actually remember playing this scenario before, but I only played it once. Yeah, I played this... Okay, I played this scenario just once and that was it, so now I'm playing it again for the sake of making a YouTube video for today. Um, tomorrow, we're going to be heading to one of the newer routes that came with Train Simulator 2 when it did come out back in... Was it 2014 or 15? I'm not exactly sure. We already have a red light, so we're already going to have to stop. I guess we'll just sit here and wait until the, red, until the light goes green. I'm not sure why it's red, but we'll probably find out. It's probably a train or stuff that's happening. Let's see. Is there a train? Okay, so there are other trains in the route. I thought I was like the only train in the world, but no. Okay, so the, the signal is green. We shall go. Not sure why it was red before, though. Probably a, uh, a programming thing in this scenario so they can make it more of a challenge. Well, <laughs> I mean, this train, the brakes aren't bad. Yesterday, we really tested the brakes with the the Class 55 Delta at the British Midlands, and uh, surprisingly, the the um the Train Simulator 2 video from yesterday got more views than the Train Simulator video Train Simulator 2 video from Monday, which is interesting. Maybe it's because more of my fans like the British Midlands route or just like British stuff. Maybe that's the case. Um, we will be driving British trains again in the future. But tomorrow, we'll be going to Canada. Yeah, that's going to be an interesting journey. Going to Canada. Canada. Yep, Canada. You can't really complain about Canada. Although, it is getting cold there. What's the top speed of these cars? See if we can test it out on the straightaway. Speed limit is 60 kilometers an hour, so maybe we can get to the top speed on this straightaway. Let's see. Hmm, 55. Alright, we're already going to have to slow down in a minute. Alright, so the next speed limit is 50 kilometers an hour. 
We're going across the cross, across the other track, tra tra tracks. Yep. I'm gonna, I'm gonna minimize the speed a little bit, not too much. Oh, we're going to the 50. All right, we're good. So yeah, so I know that you guys watch these train simulator two videos. In fact, surprisingly, um, a lot of you people that have subscribed to my channel are subscribed because I make these train related videos. You know, train drive ATS, train simulator two. I know a lot of you guys like trains and like love trains. So in fact, yeah. Uh, and I love trains too, and that's the whole reason that I do these trains videos on my channel. Yep. A nice break from racing. Yeah. Alright, so now we shall go through this tunnel, and then we'll stop at the station. So this station is called... Um, I'm not sure. I haven't actually been on this route in a while. Like, the last time that I went on this route was... I don't know. Oh, look, there's another train there. Looks like it's in an Overland train. Hello, Mr. Overland train. Hello, Mr. Overland train. Pulling the train. Going a long way. Yep. All right, stop. Uh-oh, I gotta stop, stop. Uh, no, stop, 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 stop. Uh, the train's brakes aren't that good. Like I said before, it takes a longer, takes a long time for these cars to come to a stop. These brakes aren't as, they aren't good like I said before, but we are going to stop in the right place. Is this good? Oh, nope. Ah, oh, dear, it looks like it's another one of those stop in the right place sort of situations. Just like we were in when we drive, when we drove the Santa Fe on Monday, but... That time we had a schedule to keep to. Thankfully, this time around we don't have a schedule to keep to. So we can just, um, yeah. You've arrived at Tin Knoll Station. That's what it was called. Wait a moment while the passengers board. Remember, do not depart until given the signal from the guard. Alright then. And they call them guards over here in Australia, in the UK. Yep. So I'm going to have a Forza Horizon 3 video coming out later on today. Oh, um, well, maybe it came up before this video or after this video. I'm not exactly sure. Um, but who knows. Uh, if you've seen the Forza... Well, it's a, let's just say that it's a rather interesting Forza Horizon 3 video. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Come on. I want to get moving. Come on. Yeah, we're basically just sitting here waiting for invisible passengers to board onto the train. Well, there's a few people here, but they're not doing anything, and they... Well, the whole inside of the train is green. That's interesting. Oh, look, there's the Overland train. Come on, I want to race him to the other... to the next station. I mean, I know that that Overland train is going to the same station that we're going to going to next. So let's have a race. Come on! I want to beat this train to the other station! Come on, little motor car train. We need to go as fast as we can to beat this overland train to the next station. It's a race, boys. Let's go. Yeah, it looks like the overland train has a bit of a head start, but I'm sure we can get to the next station before that train gets to. So let's see how fast these motor car cars just are, and we shall get to the next station before the other train does. Not too fast, though. There is a speed limit to keep to, unfortunately. It's not an open race track. There are speed limits. Alright, we're good. Oh, there's the Overland train. He's up there as well. We're gonna come inside for the overtake. And we're gonna go under the Overland train. There he goes up there, and here we go down here. We're gonna go across this river thingy. We're gonna pinch our way through the bridge. And we have taken the lead in this race. Ooh, we have a speed limit of 90 kilometers an hour, so we can really test out the speed in these motor cars. Here we go. Full throttle. Full throttle. Let's see how fast these things can possibly go in a straight line. 
Alrighty, it's now a race to the next station to beat the Overland train. Let's go in the map and see how far away. Oh, we're a bit close. But I think we'll be able to win. Yep. Oh, no, no, no. Uh-oh, we're speeding. I just noticed that. Oh, dear. Phew, good thing we didn't get a penalty. That was a bit close. But we have taken the lead in this race. So we just have to get to the next station and stop to win this race. Alright, we'll stay not too fast. 50. Well, 50 kilometers per hour. Alright, we'll stay like we'll stay right here. The next station is not too far away, but I kinda wanna win this race. So let's bump up the throttle a little bit. There we go. 54. We'll cruise at 54. Now how far away in the lead? Um yeah, we're fairly far. Yeah. Oh, what? I thought you were going. I thought that overland train was going to the station. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. I thought we were going to have a news, a nice train race. Oh, that's unfortunate. Well, I'm sure that we would win the race anyway. So, who cares? Yep. So, yeah, we're coming to this station. I I was excited about our race with the other Overland train, but unfortunately, um, that track that he went on doesn't go... Actually, I think it does go to the, uh, the other station. Does it? I'm not exactly sure. Hang on, let's check the map. Let's see. Uh, would he have raced us to the track? Um, no, it was on the wrong track. Okay. Did it disappear? Uh, I wonder if it disappeared or something. I don't know. Kind of wish we could have had a race, though. It would have made this scenario so much more exciting. But we're coming to a terminus station, although this doesn't mean that this is the final destination on the journey. We still have this stop and then one more stop to go. And then that will be it for this journey. So tomorrow's scenario is going to be rather, rather, rather interesting. Especially the fact that we're going to be going to Canada. Uh... I'm not sure if I'm going to make a train simulator 2 video on Friday. Maybe, maybe not. I'm I'm not exactly sure yet. Um, I'm planning on going back to the UK on Friday. Or maybe... Actually, I'm not sure where I'm going to go tomorrow. Oh, no. But uh, wherever we go tomorrow, I need to make sure that the scenario is rather short. Because if it's too long, then it'll take a long time and Alex will turn up and, uh, well, stuff will happen. So I need to make sure it's a short enough scenario so when I start recording by the time I get home on, on, uh, Friday. Time Friday. So we come to this terminus station, but again, this doesn't mean that this is the final this stop on the journey. But, uh, yeah, so let's stop. No, stop, 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 stop. We have to pull up a bit. Oh, we arrived at Mallstown Station. Wait here while the passengers board. Shouldn't be long. All right. So we're going to be going back the other way. So we're going to, what we're going to do is we're going to reverse the train facing. So reverse the train facing. Right. right. Because I know for a fact that we're going to go back the other way. In fact, we're probably going to end up at the station where we started. Hmm. Yeah, you can kind of see the end of the world. Like, if we pull up here... What's that? What's this? Oh, it's a... A lake. Looks rather dirty. Alright, right away, passengers that border doors are closed. Proceed when ready. We shall proceed now. Oops, wrong coach. Wrong coach. Oh, 
Oh, reverse the train for us when we finish loading the passengers. Okay, so I didn't need to reverse the train facing. Okay, alright. Not too fast, but not too slow. All right, we'll cruise at 26. So, I wonder if we're gonna see any trains on the on the other trains on the journey or not. Or now we're just the last train on the whole world in this journey. In this, I. All right. Interestingly, if we go over here, we can see the end of the world. Yeah. Um, kind of wish that this was an infinite world, because, you know, an infinite world would make this a lot, uh, would make it realistic. Okay. Yep. So now it's, we just go slow, or we're going to be turning left. All right. This should be interesting. Kind of want to go a bit faster here. Going rather slow. Yeah. Going over the tracks. Now we're turning um, left, yeah, left, and we'll be entering a 60 kilometer mile an hour speed limit. Unfortunately, we have no one to race, so we're just, yeah, I guess it's now it's just um, cruise on. Oh, the next signal is red. Okay, so we're not gonna just speed because the next signal is red, of course. Are we gonna see another train on our travels? I think we are. There's a train there. So we're gonna pull up to the signal and then stop. Rain going slow, 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 for something to happen. Oh, hello, Mr. Freight Train. Um, why have you stopped? There's no reason to wait. Come on, train, get moving. Look at the wheels. The wheels are moving, but they're going through the rail. That's a bit bleh. All right, signal is yellow. Time for the train to proceed. Hey, look, we're riding in the cab of a train that's not even ours. Yep, this is the thing that you can do in this game. Uh, we're we're going to pretend to drive the train, but we can't actually drive the train, but we can sit in the cab. Yep. This is nice. We're sitting in a train that's not even ours, which is interesting. I assume it's going to go into the yard. Where it's where we're going. Left or right? Right. Okay, here we go. Right. What we have behind us? Let's see. Or behind the train. We have some some flat cars with some interesting load of freight. Um why are there American box cars over here in Australia? That's a bit unrealistic. Oh, there's an Australian brake fan, that's proper, but so now we must head back to our own train because the signal is now green. But um 
Yeah, that the train is a bit unrealistic because it's pulling American box cars, and this just so happens to be an Australian route. Yeah, yeah. There's an issue with that train. Yep, the train has American box cars when this just so happens to be an Australian route. So, well, maybe it's not so unrealistic. Maybe, maybe they decided to ship those box cars abroad to show them off in other countries around the world. Interesting. Yeah, maybe they tried to make the train more interesting by putting American box cars on the Australian freight train. Speed limit is 60, nice and fast. Journey's not too far from completion, which is good. So, I was going to say something else, but I forgot what it was. Uh, yeah. So tomorrow we'll be going to Canada, which is going to be interesting. You can probably guess what train we're going to drive. Maybe. Who knows. Here we are across the bridge. Um, the overland train that we saw earlier was on that track, but we're over here on this track. So... Um, and yeah, so I was thinking that the Overland train was going to go to the station that we were going to go to, but it turns out it didn't. And we're going to have to stop here, because we're going to re be reversing back to the station where it all began. Alright, we need to stop, 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 stop. Alrighty, here we are. Oh, no, no, stop, 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 stop. Stop! Ooh, yes, we're stopped. Alrighty. Reverse the train back up the branch line to the park station. Alrighty, we shall. Just reverse train facing. Get into the front coach. And reverse the train back up to Central Park. Where we shall park this train for the day. And then we'll see you tomorrow. Actually, no, I, I do have another video coming out today. It might, it might already be out. Who knows? Uh, it's Rift Forza Horizon 3 related. So, I'm not sure if it's going to come out before this video or after this video, but who knows. Not too fast. Now, there are, there are buffers at the end of this line, so we have to make sure that we don't overrun them, or else we will fail the whole scenario, that would be terrible, because this scenario has lasted quite a bit of time, and I don't want that time to go to waste, because then to this video is going to be cancelled, and I'll have to do it all over again at some point. So, yep, here we are at, um, what's it called again? Central Park? I, I don't know. Central Park, eh? Uh, but no, actually, Central Park is in New York. This is Australia. Maybe they, or was it called Nathan Park? I'm not too sure. We're going to see it right here. So, it's called Nath National Park. Oh, All right now, break. Yeah, we have to pull up a little bit. And stop here. Yes, we did it! Game of Granite successfully complete the thingy scenario. Yep. Congratulations, you have successfully completed the session. Close this menu to return to the main menu. And there we go! This scenario is completed! Uh, I'll write later. So, yeah. So there we go, midday passenger is complete. 
So tomorrow we'll be heading to Canada, which is gonna which is gonna make for an interesting scenario. But guys, that is it for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.